The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are going to visit the UK next month for the first time since returning for the, from the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. They'll also be fitting in a visit to Germany, and it's all in the week that the new Prime Minister is going to be chosen. Well, Nick Qureshi is here. Uh, what are they, exactly are they doing, Nick? OK, so early June they were last here. That was for the Platinum Jubilee. They attended a Thanksgiving service for the Queen's long reign at St Paul's Cathedral, but otherwise kept a low profile. What are they doing? Um, Manchester, September the 5th for the One Young World Summit. They'll then head to Germany before returning on the 8th for the Well Child Awards in London, something very close to, to Harry's heart. And, in fact, these charities close uh, to both their hearts. Security, of course, is going to be at the forefront uh, of Prince Harry's mind, bringing... Uh, Megan from uh, California. Of course, he gave up being a senior working royal in 2020. Now, bringing legal action against the Home Office over a decision not to allow him to pay for police protection for himself and his family when he's here. Now, what about the timing? Because it is a busy week, isn't it? Mm, interesting, uh, some might say. The new Prime Minister will be named on the 5th, the very day that he uh, comes to Manchester or they come to Manchester, uh, asked to form a government uh, by the Queen, the new Prime Minister. She's due to return uh, from Balmoral to carry out her duties. Unclear at this stage if uh, Harry is going to meet his grandmother. But overshadowing this, perhaps, this all uh, tell all but the royal family uh, bracing itself for what Prince Harry has vowed will be an accurate and wholly truthful account of his life. It was projected that this would come out in autumn. That's the usual time for books of this nature come out, October. So uh, I think the whole family is on tenterhooks actually about what's going to be in that memoir. It will be the elephant in the room if he sees any members of the family. So will Harry delve into his rift with his brother, explore his fractious relationship with his father or pursue that damning accusation that an unnamed royal had made a racist remark? We will find out. Nick, thanks very much indeed for that.